what's going on guys welcome back to a brand new video and in today's video to celebrate the release of counter-strike 2 i'm going to be showing you guys how to turn your steam funds or your skins into real money so as many of you may know already or maybe you've ran into this problem yourself if you have a skin in your inventory that you want to sell for money for example with this ak if i click sell and i sell this on the community market i can sell it for you know maybe the last price it was sold for so let's do 47 dollars 46 okay just to make sure that it sells pretty quick now you'll see here that steam takes a pretty big fee from this it turns your 47 dollars into 41 dollars 21 and on top of that that money gets locked into your steam balance and there's no way to withdraw this money right here whatever money is in your steam wallet you cannot withdraw you can only spend on the community market and on the store to buy other games so i'm going to be showing you guys right here right now how to turn your skins into real money so the first thing i would recommend you doing is coming to this website right here it's called priceempire.com this is the website I use every single time I'm going to sell my skin so that I can know how much my skin is worth and I can understand how much to expect from that skin. So if we go back to our inventory, let's say we're trying to sell this M9 Bayonet Forest DD pad. It's in field tested condition. So what I would do is just copy and paste this right here into Price Empire. And then we want to select the field tested version. Another thing that's important to understand is that real money, for example, money that's in your bank account or PayPal account is going to be worth a lot more obviously than your steam wallet money meaning that if a skin can sell for $500 on the community market on steam for steam wallet funds it will be substantially less on other websites third-party websites which is the method that we're gonna be using today meaning that if an item will sell for about $544 on the steam market it's gonna sell for less real-world money because that money is actually withdrawable you can do anything you want with that money and it's not going to be locked into anything it's going to be directly in your paypal directly in your bank account whichever one you choose it's not going to be locked into steam so for example this m9 bayonet in field tested is worth about 544 dollars on the steam market if we come over here and we check price empire i really like this website because it will give you an accurate representation of how much your skin is really worth so for example it'll show us the top three websites that it recommends obviously it's going to recommend d market because they have a sponsorship but you can get a decent amount of money over there on d market and it will show you all of this information there's a ton of websites that you can look through and you can look right here at this price tab to see how much your skin is worth on those different websites and keep in mind if you sell your skin on these websites you can take this money out directly to your bank account so i would recommend choosing one that person you trust or you're familiar with I personally am comfortable with pretty much any website on this list but I do actually have some preferences the websites that I would personally go for are the ones with the low selling fees what I would personally recommend is either CS float because they take 2% fee D market because they also take a 2% fee or gamer pay gamer pay takes a zero percent fee from your sales i have a couple items already listed on cs float just because i like that website i like the interface check out my last video if you want to see more about cs float it's as easy as going over here clicking buy now and then you can look at the cs float information for the skin that you want to sell and this works for any skin not just the m9 bayonet it can work for any skin that you want to sell this ak for example this flip knife this huntsman knife, any skin that you want to sell, you can do the same exact method for. So if we come back to CS float and we click on one of these offerings, one of these listings right here, we'll see a graph of how often this skin sells and for about how much it sells for. I personally prefer to use the table over here, but you can use whichever one you like. And if you click on this table, it will show you how often this skin sells. So it sold seven days ago, 22 days ago, and about a month ago. So it sells about three times a month, I would say, and it goes for about this price so this price range right here is what you can expect to get for your knife so it's as easy as logging into the website keeping note of how much the most recent ones sell for and keeping note of how much the ones are for on the market if you want to sell your skin quicker you would just undercut the market so for example if this skin is selling for 411 dollars what you could do is put yours up for 411 as well and you would sell it but it would probably take a week or two weeks to sell it or 
you can come over here just go straight to your inventory click on sell items so currently my m9 bayonet is not tradable but we can do this example on the flip knife if i click on it again i can look at the table and i can see that this actually sells quite frequently it sold a day ago yesterday four days ago five days ago nine days ago etc etc and it sells for about a hundred and i would say a hundred and 85 dollars to the 170 dollars range so what i could do is just click on sell item and i could sell it for the recommended price and it would probably sell pretty quickly or if i wanted to sell it fast what i could do is slightly undercut the lowest selling if i click on this right here on this flip knife rust coat and i click search on cs float you can see right here that the lowest sale right now for this exact skin is 179 dollars 99 cents so if i wanted to sell this skin quickly what i could do is go over here to the sell tab and slightly undercut them so instead of 179.99 i could type in 178.99 i will lose around a dollar on this sale compared to if I would have just sold for a higher price, but this will ensure that my skin sells quickly. This will be the first listing that people see whenever they go to search up for a flip knife rust code. And you'll see down here, this website does take a 2% sale fee, which is about $3.58. At the end of the day, I will end up with $175.41 that can be instantly withdrawn from the website and put in either my PayPal or my bank account. And you do that just from going up here and clicking on withdraw. Now, I personally like using CS Float the most, but I'll show you guys this for the other websites as I recommend it as well so that you can understand pretty much how easy it is. So, for example, we can go to DMarket as well because I recommend this website. And once you're on DMarket, it's basically the same thing, but just with a different UI. This right here is the market for the skins. And you can go up here and click on sell inventory. Now, normally it'll show you your inventory and your skins, and you'll just be able to put them on sale the same way as you would CS Float. Unfortunately, this website is down currently because CS2 came out. They're having some problems. By the time this video gets out, hopefully it'll be fixed. And you can pretty much use it any site you want to sell your skins and to with withdraw that money right back in your paypal account so gone are the days of selling your skins on the steam market and not being able to do anything with that money now you can sell your skins directly on these websites again i recommend the websites that are on price empire because pretty much all these websites are safe trusted and usable the only thing that i will say is that if you are from the u.s you have a hard time selling on buff.163 because it's region locked, it's not actually available in the US. I would recommend buff.163 over all of my other recommendations, although I cannot use it, but buff.163 is one of the best websites to sell skins on. Again, to recap, if you are looking at sites to sell your skins on and you're not sure, I would definitely recommend either CS Float, DMarket, or GamerPay. Those are the three websites that I'm the most familiar with. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I tried to get straight to the point. Don't want to waste your guys' time. Have fun with CS2. Have fun with trading. And uh, have fun with all your investments and making money out there, guys. I really appreciate you for watching. Make sure you subscribe and stick around if you want to see more content. I'm coming out with a lot of investment content soon. A lot of trading content soon. And a lot of CS2 news soon. So, again, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.